Welcome to the world of John Singer Sargent, one of the most esteemed artists of the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Born in 1856 in Florence, Italy, Sargent was fortunate enough to grow up in an artistic household, as his parents were both talented artists themselves. This early exposure to the world of art would truly shape his path in life. At the age of 20, Sargent moved to Paris to study art at the prestigious École des Beaux-Arts. It was during this time that he honed his skills and developed a deep understanding of the techniques and styles that would become the foundation of his work. It was also in Paris that he formed lasting friendships with some of the most influential artists of his time, such as Claude Monet and Auguste Rodin. Sargent's artistic journey took him to various parts of the world, including France, Italy, and the United States. His travels provided him with a wealth of inspiration, resulting in a diverse range of works. Take, for example, his painting La Pierre du Champ d'Olent, created in 1889. This powerful piece captures the rugged beauty of the French countryside, depicting a solitary stone against a dramatic backdrop. It showcases Sargent's ability to capture both the grandeur and the subtleties of nature. In Italian model from 1904, Sargent turns his attention to capturing the allure and grace of a model from Italy. The vibrant colors and meticulous attention to detail bring the subject to life, highlighting Sargent's skilled portraiture. Moving on to 1925, we have Woman with Collie, a charming painting that showcases Sargent's ability to capture human connection. The woman's affectionate gaze towards her loyal canine companion is depicted with warmth and tenderness. Another work from 1905, Gondolier's Siesta, transports us to the enchanting canals of Venice. Sargent masterfully captures the tranquility and languid mood of a sun-soaked afternoon, with gondoliers taking a well-deserved break. The play of light and shadow adds a touch of magic to the scene. Sandalis from 1926 is another example of Sargent's ability to capture the vibrant energy of his subjects. This lively depiction of a group of dancers in colorful attire exudes joy and movement, showcasing Sargent's eye for capturing the essence of a moment. One of his more renowned works, The Desert from Jerusalem created in 1905, is a breathtaking landscape that encapsulates the vastness and mystery of the desert. Sargent's ability to capture the vastness and desolation of this otherworldly landscape is nothing short of extraordinary. Through his captivating portraits, Sargent also sought to convey the essence of his subjects. Portrait of a Lady, created in 1923, exemplifies this approach. The subject's confidence and elegance are emphasized through Sargent's masterful brushwork and attention to detail. In Mrs. Theodore Frothingham, Jr. from 1924, Sargent captures the grace and poise of his subject, while also hinting at the underlying complexity of her character. And let's not forget the Duke of York from 1923, a regal and dignified portrait that showcases Sargent's ability to capture the essence of his high-profile subjects. Finally, we have Mrs. Mabel Hunt Slater from 1917, a striking portrait that exudes both strength and vulnerability. Sargent's ability to convey the complexities of his subjects shines through in this compelling piece. John Singer Sargent's life experiences, travels, and friendships undoubtedly influenced his artwork, allowing him to create a body of work that captured the beauty and complexity of the world around him. These selected pieces are just a glimpse into the immense talent and skill of this remarkable artist. Join us as we delve deeper into the world of John Singer Sargent, exploring the stories behind his incredible artistry.